I'm low-key hot. We know you are, baby. Ooh, you got me feeling your vibe. Got me feeling so hot, got me in the sky. I'm saying a night, boy. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brianna Elliott, and as you can tell from the title of the video, you are watching a wash and go routine for my curly hair. So this video has been long anticipated, long expected, long hyped up, and I'm really excited to film it today. So yeah, as you could tell, my hair. It's not really doing a thing, but, um, I mean, it's just very, hold up. Once I get the camera set up, I can take down my hair and show y'all what's happening. Y'all gonna be like, sis, let me get the camera set up first, and then I'm gonna explain to y'all what is gonna go down. Okay, so, basically, what's gonna happen is, I'm gonna take down my hair, I'm going to detangle it, and then I'm gonna hop in the shower and wash it, and deep condition all that kind of stuff. And I'm come, gonna come back and show you all the products that I put in it. Let's hop right into it, I guess. Okay, so in order to detangle my hair, I'm just going to be using some water in a spray bottle, my wide tooth comb, and if it gets really like hard to detangle, I'm gonna be using some of my Aussie Moist or Aussie Mega Moist conditioner. And so I'm just gonna be sectioning it into four, depending on how hard it is to detangle, maybe six sections, and just spray it down, detangle it, and that's what y'all about to see. Key, separating my hair into sections is the hardest part. One, because I'm super tender headed, and two, I always let my hair get so tangled and it just hurts really bad. And it takes like a long time. Anyway, back to your regularly scheduled. What is it? Back to your regularly scheduled programming. Okay, so basically that took an hour just to detangle and braid my hair, all that kind of stuff. And at some point my camera stopped recording, but I couldn't hear it because I was playing music. But anyways, as you can see, I just have my hair in these four braids. And in these four braids, I'm going to get in the shower. Um, and then I'm going to shampoo my hair with my Aussie Mega Moist shampoo. And then I'm going to be deep conditioning with my Aussie Moist Three Minute Miracle deep conditioner. And then again, I'm gonna be using this same Aussie Mega Moist conditioner. Um, so as you can tell, I like Aussie. Aussie works really well in my hair. It just leaves it very hydrated so we love Ozzy in this piece. I'm gonna go 
get in the shower, wash my hair, all that kind of stuff. And I will be back when I am done. Okay, so obviously I'm back from the shower. And I'm going to be putting the products in my hair. So, ooh, ooh, ooh. It's a piercing. Okay. So this is what my hair looks like. I just wrap it in like a cotton t-shirt, of course. I feel so much guys. Oh my gosh. Um, anyways, yeah, my hair looks like crusty because the braids have been in this whole time. First product. The Shea Moisture Manuka Honey and Mafura Oil Intense Hydration Leave-In Milk. Um, I've never used this product before, but I've been looking for a new leave-in conditioner, so. And then, I'm gonna, this is not in the order either, because I don't really have a beer that I get. Um, the Cantu Coconut Curling Cream. That's like a staple. Um, the Miss Jessie's Coily Custard with Agave and Coconut Oil. Obviously, my Green Eco Stylo Gel. And then, just my Cloud 11 Hair and Skin Cream. And all the products that I'm using will be linked down below in the description box. And then I think I'm also going to use my Demi brush, which I'm not going to show because it's kind of gross. But... Yeah, and then obviously you'll need some water as well. I'm gonna go ahead and clip up these three. And cue the fast forward. this cute fun little thing where it dies without telling me that it's gonna die so it's currently the battery is currently charging i just put the leave-in conditioner and i'm gonna finish up this section and kind of just like kind of style it a little bit and then let it dry about 60 percent of the way and then diffuse it for the rest but yeah so okay so real quick i wanted to show y'all i don't really like having a part 
So I'll like flip my hair all the way back like this. And then just take a little bit more of the coily custard to help like put it back without it getting frizzy or anything. And then I'll style my curls to the back just so that once they dry, then I can part them and like do fun things, but I don't like being constricted, you know what I mean? And then I'll take a little bit more gel. Like literally a little bit, like that much. And put it. And I know it kind of looks crazy at first, but trust me. Trust me. So now I'm gonna go ahead and do my baby hairs. When your hair gets to a certain length, though, it's like hard to keep all the hair back. Okay, and then. Last but not least, I'm just gonna take my scarf from Diva Curl. I just gotta tie my hair back with it. Like, not tight or anything. It keeps it out of the way. It helps to tame it a little bit. It also keeps me from touching it while it dries. Yeah. I don't take it. Leave. So, yeah, I'm just gonna. Like that, I'm gonna do that for about it's like four o'clock now, probably till about six. It should be mostly dry. I'm gonna do some homework, clean up, probably wash my makeup brushes. I really need to do that, but yeah. And my camera battery will probably be charged by then, so okay. So it's like 6 30 now, so it's been about two and a half hours, and my hair is like I don't know, it's maybe. It's like 60% dry, um, but it is kind of chilly because y'all know it's winter or whatever and I want to go outside. So I'm going to defuse my hair the rest of the way or try to at least. So yeah, I just used this diffuser. I got it from TJ Maxx for like $25. So it's just a blow dryer. And I came with these two attachments. It's really cute. It doesn't have like the best power if you're like to, if you're trying to like blow straight, but it works. I mean, like it works. So yeah, yeah. Let's get this drawn on and popping. I have it on like the medium heat, so it'll go by faster without like burning me or anything. Then I'm gonna. Go Okay, so look, my camera is obviously playing games with me today because first, battery died. And then I got like five seconds into filming me diffusing my hair and I ran out of storage. So I'm gonna have to go to the store tomorrow and pick up a new SD card. But pretty much, it's not completely dry. It's not gonna dry tonight. I've already come to that conclusion, but it's really defined. It's really soul. It's pretty dry. It's like 95% dry. So yeah, this is just what it looks like. It's really long. It's like down to my hips or whatever. What is even going on? I don't see at this point. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, give us a huge thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, and like I said, if you enjoyed it, make sure you share this video with a friend. And I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one. Period. Ugh. I'm sorry. Bye. I stay falling for you. I stay falling. I stay falling. I stay falling for you. I stay falling.